Hey, what is going on everybody and welcome to Fantasia for today. We're going to be jumping into another session of Epic 7L today. Got some more RTA for you guys. Been starting to know- ooh, that guy has really good taste by the way. Lydica, top tier waifu. Anyway, we're getting a little sidetracked here. <laughs> Been noticing that a lot of people, a lot of people, have been first picking Maya. So, uh, thankfully, this guy actually bans Ron and Zio. I'm tired of fighting cleavers. Uh, so let's go ahead and pick Maya first. Take it away from my opponents, because uh, she is quite annoying to fight against when they pair her up with certain units. You know, like the Luas and stuff like that. That you know are kind of iffy to fight. But she's really annoying when she's paired with units like Aeola, and I stopped pre-banning Aeola because Laya is available as a unit. So I, I really want to make sure that I have access to her, so let's, let's kind of make this a Laya video, hopefully. See how she is uh, as a first pick unit. There's no DDR on the other side that came out here, which is good. There's all He also took the Bunny Dom for C. Lilius. Hmm, interesting. I can't take the DDR because he took the Bunny Dom. It's kind of putting myself at a disadvantage, it's kind of counter-picking against myself here, but dual attacks here, maybe Lionheart's pretty good, let's go for Lionheart, she's starting to see a resurgence in the meta I feel, because there's so many dual attack units now, especially with Lion so popular, I think Lionheart's a pretty solid pick. Uh, this also makes it so that Lionheart can't be used against me, which I also do like. Uh, we can go for, maybe we can go for an 8 high win, that seems like a pretty decent pick here. Let's see if he'll go LRK, if he goes LRK, we might be able to go for Dragon King Sharoon or something like that, someone who can strip the, uh, the buffs off my opponents, and perhaps defense break. Dragon King Sharoon's pretty good, oh shoot, never mind guys, my opponent's gonna take the Dragon King Sharoon and the DDR, wow, he's going full on degen mode here with, uh, just triple soul weavers and a... Um, and to see Lilius. Now, that's actually pretty nasty. I can't even Dark Corvus this team because uh, the DDR there with the injury is going to be pretty bad. Alright, how do we how do we kind of go about this? You can't Rylet this team. What do we do? Uh, Dilibet. Actually, Dilibet seems really good here. Let's go for Dilibet, yeah? Who's another good cleanser for the team? Dilibet's pretty good. Um, is Champ C good here? Actually, Champ C would be pretty decent. Let's go for a Champion Zerato. I think he's he, I think he's all right. Let's go Champ C. Can't do anything about the Champ C here. Apoc Ravi, ban that. We'll fight the rest of this, right? We'll fight this. Bring it on. Bring it on. Let's see what we got. We got a Cleanser and Laya, Cleanser and Dilibet. We got Champ Z as well. No immunity buffers. We got Cleansing and a Tywin. He bans a Dilibet. Alright. Who do we want to have more HP? Laya can have HP. Champ Z can have HP. I think Lionheart's good because she has um, she has lifesteal. But Champ Z does as well, but he's a bit slower, so... Lionheart should be able to turn cycle quite well with uh, this C. Uh, Lilius on the other side. He's going to have quite a few dual attacks going on. Uh, he will get Bunny Dom's effect off if um, Lionheart S3s, like if I don't kill, right, with the S3, then uh, we get the extra turn so Bunny Dom gets skill known everybody, I just need to watch out for that, otherwise I think we're good. Hit the Champsy, I know you want to, just do it. Hit the Champsy, oh he's gonna be attack, ooh look, so we cleansed everybody, right, look at that, we cleansed everybody, proc the Lionheart, he might push up his DDR here. He might push, but if he does that, that's a cleanse that he's wasting, so that's not terrible. If his DDR takes the turn, if Sharoon pushes everyone back, and then DDR takes the turn, I'm fine with that. Very much fine with that. Go for it. You know you want to S3. You know you want to S3. Yes. Okay, push back the Laya, please, because then we can cleanse with Laya and get all the debuffs off of everybody. Okay? That's what I'm looking for here. Pretty good. Champ C getting that little counterattack going. Not bad, not bad. Come on, DDR, you know you want to pop it. Pop the skill. Do the S3. Oh, there we go. Beautiful stuff, guys. <laughs> what is going on? Oh, wait a minute. Hang on. I didn't even notice. We're fighting Deity. Wait. <laughs> We're fighting Deity. I can't believe it. That's awesome. Um, huge fan of DD's content, by the way. He does a lot of good guides for um, players who are like starting out. Like he does new accounts and he like climbs up with his new accounts in RTA to show you how to progress. Pretty good. But uh, let's let's go ahead and play this out though. It's gonna be quite fun. 
because I, I, I looked up, I was like, I recognize that guild, Malagoose, that's the one that Deity's in. Oh yeah, no, that's uh, that's definitely the one Deity's in. Alright, so, a Tywin. You want to just break all the skill nulls here? Might as well, let's just go for it. Break all the skill nulls, get some damage. No need to hold on to it, right? Deal some damage to this uh, bunny dom. Oh, he's just gonna injury down the Lia, because he doesn't want Lia to kind of burst me down. Um, to burst him down, uh, I mean. But Lionheart's gonna be doing a lot of that work here. My Lionheart's also on Durandal, so I just hope he kind of hits the Lionheart so we get to push up. Nope, he's just gonna keep hitting this. He's gonna keep hitting Lia. Okay. Uh, let's go for the. Oh, that's some nice damage from Champsy there. Look at that Bunny Dom, just getting shredded. Right. Ooh, he's gonna sleep the Lionheart, okay. Champsy finally gets to go. Let's go for the S3, hopefully this kills Bunny Dom here. He does have damage mitigation on this team. Um, so there we go, Bunny Dom is dead. <laughs> there we go, guys. Look at that, another Champsy game on our hands. Uh, yeah, so if he keeps hitting Lionheart, it's fine, because we have Durandal, so we're good. We're gonna be turn cycling like crazy here. Well, nice, we're resisting some of the Venoms, at the very least. Let's provoke the... Let's provoke the Sea Lilius. Or not. Didn't need to provoke anyway, I guess. Let's kill the DDR, he's really annoying. Oh, good job, Champsy. Good hit. When Champsy dual attacks, he's on, um, what is it called? Fairy Tail for Nightmare, so it counts as a dual attack, so he does extra damage. And Laia, he's just focusing down Laia, because that Laia is going to be trouble for him. Didn't, we resisted the stun, because we have a increased effect res buff here. Oh, he's sleeping the line. He doesn't want Lionheart to burst. It's over if we burst. Oh, yeah, and he's going to call it quits. <laughs> Good match, Deity. I don't know, that's kind of a weird draft, man. Uh, without any damage. Against against a team like this, like this could actually work. The, the, the scary thing is, a team like Deity can actually work. But I feel like it wasn't a great pick when Lionheart's on the other side, because you get punished by her just being a threat there, right? And Laia being a, a reliable cleanser. Alright, but that was pretty cool, that was pretty fun. Champ Z coming back out here. 100% win rate this season so far, one for one. Uh, let's see if we can uh, <laughs> get some funny things going with him. Wow. I need to pay more attention to people's names and things, and of course, of course, now it all makes sense. Of course Didi has great taste, right? He's a huge Lydica fan. His Fire Lydica is amazing, too. Um, alright, let's, let's, <laughs> now, now it's all clicking. Alright, let's go for these two again, band out. Ron band, DDR band, it's, it's a weird combination of bands, again. You could see DDR, Ron together in an aggro team, it's just not very common. But he's trying to prevent the cleaves, I guess, from coming out here. Uh, what do I want to do into this? Uh, first pick. He had DDR. I kind of like picking DDR, but let's go for let's go for an Arwell. Yeah, LRK. I feel like is too vulnerable. It's just way too vulnerable to. Um, Oh shoot, you know what? Ah, oh, I did it again. I should've instead of picking a knight, I should have picked Laya. I should have picked Laya, guys. Uh, it's fine, it's fine. He has so many dual attack units on his side. Let's go for a Lionheart here. Again, like I mentioned, Lionheart seeing a huge resurgence, at least from my perspective, in viability because of Laya existing. Um, double dual attacks on their side, so that's good. He can go for non-attack skills. I could try to go for a unit that punishes non-attack skills. We can go for something like a Winter here, actually. Winter would be pretty good. Yeah, no, that's not too bad. Navy Captain Landy. Ooh, for the anti-crit, huh? But hey, we got Lionheart to help out with that. Might be okay, unless of course this Landy dual attacks like crazy with these, these two units, and then we're screwed. Strazi getting picked out. Um, could we technically go for Zeo? Zeo seems a little weak here, though, because he has Navy Captain Landy. I don't think we can really contest the Sea of Lilius, besides using Zeo, though. But the Strazé is, uh, is a little concerning. Strazé is a little concerning, for sure. Do I want to use DJB? But then who? Like, DJB and what, right? Uh, 
uh, we, we can use DJB. Let's use DJB and then a damage dealer. So we can go for something like... What's a decently fast damage dealer we can bring along? Actually, Minigal Lilius might not be a terrible option. Just because we can have the crits against the Emma Landy, but I don't know if I want that Emma Landy to stay alive. The dual attacks into Minigal Lilius might hurt, but then we have Lionheart here. I don't know. It's going to be interesting, to say the least. Aeola, huh? A lot of non-attack skill units on their side. Selene. We have to ban the Selene. Or do we? Unless he's banning Minigal Lilius. Because... He's not banning DJB, is he? He's using Selene for the winter, that's right. He's using Selene for winter. No, this is okay, we'll do this. Alright, he's banning the Minigal Lilius! Actually, that is exactly what I wanted. I was hoping we got to pick a unit that he would ban. This is great. We're gonna keep effect res on the DJB. I don't want him to get provoked by the C Lilius, or does it really matter? That's a lot of HP I could give the team. No, no, no. DJB needs that resist against C. If we get provoked, it's over, right? So we can't have that. Okay. I think he's gonna go for the provoke, which is why I picked DJB, because if he provokes with his S2, we get a, uh, he gets a barrier, which means I get to barrier invert him. So he is gonna go for the S3. Winter is gonna proc. She is gonna get, um, immunity here. Alright, so she gets immunity. She's gonna proc. There we go. And he could dual attack into the Winter. My Winter's pretty tanky, though. There is anti-crit on everyone, which is something to keep in mind. Ooh, he's gonna provoke the R. Well, okay. So look, this is fine, because we get to bury Invert here. Which is nice. And uh, the unfortunate thing is, Straze is gonna be scary. Super, super scary. Because look at this guy. He is sitting there with... Uh, with immunity. I was not expecting Straza to have immunity. I thought Winter would be able to go and stun him. So, now we're in trouble. <laughs> now we're in trouble. Uh, we have to stun this. So, we're gonna go for the Laia. We have a two-turn stun here. So she only decreases buff durations by one turn. We have to go for this. I think Arwell's dead from the Straza. Right, but a two-turn stun, so that's good. Okay, Arwal's 100% dead here. And we're just gonna have to rely on Lionheart for, for everything, so... Let's see what we can do. Let's go for a hit onto... Oh, Strazi has invincibility too now. That kinda sucks. Uh, let's try to stun him. Debuff him. Oh, decrease speed is not terrible. Can we stun him? I really need to stun him here. Done? No stun. Okay, we're still creeping up on him. Uh, Lionheart should be able to take the turn here. Okay, yeah, there we go. Very nice. We propped our S2. And now we can come in for a big attack with our S3. I'm just worried about the Strazi taking his next turn. It's it's gonna hurt like crazy. Uh, we can go for the Lya. Why is still an S2? She could cleanse and push up the team. I'm just gonna go ahead and kill the Sea Lilius. Because that's one less unit I have to deal with that's turn cycling around. So she is gonna cleanse and push up. Maybe Captain Landy thankfully has encountered here, so she doesn't get a ton of fighting spirit. Alright, Winter's gonna reset, that's good. Um Stealth keeps me from taking too much damage. DJB goes down. Lionheart, ooh, he might actually just kill Winter here with the extra attack. Ooh, please don't kill. Ooh, Lionheart! Lionheart! Hang on just a second here. Hang on just a second here. Please don't proc a counterattack. Please don't proc a counterattack. We need to kill, like, everything. Okay. Very nice. Very, very nice. Um... I kill the Laia. I'm gonna kill the Laia for sure. Alright, Winter, we just have to try and see if we crit. If we don't crit, we don't stun, so we, uh, Winter's pretty bad as a matchup into Lionheart. Oh, no crit, so no uh, extra damage there. What can we do? There's no, there's no, no reason to Soulburn. We do have an artifact for Alabastron. Oh, nice, speed down. It's not terrible. It's not terrible. No counter still. Okay. Can we get, like, a attack down or something? 
Nope, just decrease speed again. All right, let's go get some health back here with the soul burns. Oh, nice, nice counter attack. Actually, that's a bad counter attack. Wait a minute, we're screwed. <laughs> He's gonna kill. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, it's over. <laughs> Oh, we tried our best. Oh, shoot, guys. If if uh, Winter had crit there, it would have been nice, but it's only a 30% chance. Oh, well. That's okay. Uh, what could we have done? I was just not... Honestly? Honestly? I was not expecting Strazi to be on immunity. That was the main thing. If Strazi wasn't on immunity, we would have been fine, because Winter could easily just go into the Strazi and stun him. But would that actually have mattered? Because Laia would have gone, right? Maybe it wouldn't have mattered. Maybe it wouldn't have mattered. But if we landed a stun on the Strazze with like Winter or DJB, like the second time around, uh, when he was invincible, it would have stopped his S2 damage, which was huge, right? If we stopped his S2 damage, it would have been great. But then again, we also got lucky. So I don't know. Maybe it's just meant to. It was meant to be a loss. Because we got lucky in terms of the ML landing not really countering. But yeah, anyway. Jacko DDR banned. Again, that's really strange. Wait a minute. It's kind of getting like deja vu here. Anyway, uh, let's go for Laia. Laia's just a great unit, right? Our opponent was using Laia there and they won, so let's go for Laia first pick. I just want to use her more. She's so fun. She's so fun. She enables so much stuff and she shuts down a lot of counterplay from your opponent in terms of, uh, like, you can't use Lua and knock walls and stuff like that, which I, I really much appreciate. Bunny Dom getting picked out, there's no DDR, so Laia's pretty great, because no Shu, no DDR means no reliable injury on the other side. Of course you have things like Alencia, Ilana, things like that, but they're not versatile enough in RTA to be used, that's why they kind of fallen off, right? Alencia fell off really, really hard when she used to be super meta. Uh, Arawal getting picked up here, that's okay. That's a stun, Bunny Dom has sleep. Let's go for uh, Dragon King Sharoon, that's pretty good. Let's go for a Spez as well. We can definitely get counterpicked by stuff like Bryceria here, but I'm for it. That's fine. Oh, he's gonna go Navy Captain Landy. Okay, a lot of people are just resorting to Navy Captain Landys. I don't know. Uh, we can try going for Bibulus and Aeola. Aeola's fine because we have we have Laia. Let's go for Bibulus and uh, ML Bologna. I think Bologna's gonna be really nice here. Let's go with Bologna. Let's go Bibulus. Right, because that's a lot of AoEs coming his way. So we'll break this. We don't care about the skill moles. We're just going to break through them. And uh, we'll try our best to um, burst down this Navy Captain Landy as soon as possible. See if Biblis can do anything here. What would be a good last pick for him? Lionheart would be a decent last pick. He could go for Rowana. I have to ban Rowana there. I'm banning his last pick regardless, but... You know, he has a few options that he can go for to force a ban. If he picks something really weak, I could always ban something. Yeah, see, look, we can, we can just get rid of the Lionheart here. Um, or do we? Or do we? Because if we have Spez, can't we just burst down this, this Lionheart? Nah, I think we fight the Navy Captain. Do we fight the Navy Captain Landy? We might be able to get this lion. We might be able to get this lion heart. Okay, yeah, there we go. I, th I think that was the right ban because if he bans Bologna, I ban the Emilandi. We can crit this guy, this lion heart. I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're fine. Let's give it a shot. Let's see what happens. Lion heart. Give me a little iffy to navigate around, but let's see how it goes. Do I prompt the lion heart immediately? Hmm. The thing is, by banning the Navy Captain Landy is, uh, we don't have, um, we don't have any, like, counters for Bibulus to kind of work off of, so we, we can just use her for the S3s. Let's see what happens. Unless they have, like, a counter r -wall or something, I don't know. It's the only downside, so we're kind of down a unit, because Bibulus' support capabilities are kind of hindered in this regard. Maybe I should have banned, maybe I should have banned Lionheart. Maybe if I fought the Navy Captain Landy, it would have been fine. I don't know. We'll see. Let's see how it goes. We get crit? Nope. Good. Spez lives. That's fine. Who's he kill? He's gonna kill Dragon King Sharoon, I think. 
It's either that or Laya. Okay, he's gonna go for the Shrew. Ooh, I didn't expect him to actually kill the Shrew straight up. Um, let's go for this. Nope, no pushback, no silence. Alright, who's he gonna stun? Oh, that's unfortunate, because I wanted the Dragon King Sharoon for the stun that was gonna come out. He's gonna go for Bibulus, which I think is fine. I think we're losing this, though. Kind of unfortunate, but I think we're losing this. It's a bad ban on my part there. Oh, yeah, he's gonna be focusing on Spez. Uh, we could push up. Oh, shoot, he actually hit us there. Let's let's push up, let's cleanse. That is fine, okay. Uh, we can go for... Oh, you know what? Does this CR push back? Okay, let's try to push back the Lionheart, please. No! No! Why'd that happen? Oh, God. We would have had it! Spez would have come in, we would have S3'd. No! Guys, we got scammed! What? No! You're kidding me! You're kidding me! What? Anyway, Lionheart, I'm just telling you guys, good investment! If you have a Lionheart, if you picked her from like the Moonlight events or whatever, Look at that, she's good to go. Really, really strong right now uh, in, in the meta. Wow, that was awful. I know I know, I did a bad ban there. That was a bad ban on my part. Should have kept the Navy Captain Landy in because of the Bibulus, but th that was disgusting, wasn't it? Because she gains that combat brainness back when she procs rest too. I was going to go with Spez. He was going to come in and just he's gonna grab her and she's extinct. She's over. The match was over. Um... Oh, that, that 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 really bums me out there. That's kind of sad. All right, let's see if we can make a comeback here. I think we've lost everything so far except the first match. So, come on now. You gonna pick Lia first? You gonna take the Lia? Banman, I got Lilias. That's actually okay. Aeolas banned too, so you could take the Lia, and I'm okay with that. Mostly because I don't want to fight Aeolas. Was there an Aeola in the last game? There was, wasn't there? It was an Aeola in the last game. I feel like I just lose to Aeola all the time still. So. I don't know. Oh, look, there's a Lia first pick. All right. Yeah, Aeol is just a unit I hate, absolutely despise fighting against. There's so little you can do against her. And if, if you want to fight her, you can. You just have to kind of draft entirely around her, right? All of your units must be used to, to counter her in some way or play around her in some way, which is really annoying. But, uh, let's go for... I mean, he banned Minigal Lilia, so this is a good time to use Last Rider Crown. I'm scared. I'm scared of picking a time because apparently everybody now has Dragon King Sharoon. For some reason, even though everyone said that she's trash, but everyone somehow has her. So, <laughs> I'm a little scared of picking a time Um, uh, let's go for LRK and, uh, Lionheart. Pretty safe picks into Lia, I think. Especially with ML Shu Band and, uh, Minigal Lilia's Band. Let's see what they go for here. We can always go for DDR, right? DDR is a pretty fantastic pick for injury into this Laia. Because we're already punishing her with... Oh, shoot, they're going for DDR. Uh, don't like that. We can go for Bunny Dom, I guess. Elvira, shutting us down. Ooh, I don't like that. Shutting down the Lionheart is huge here. So let's go for... Um, Bunny Dom. Is this where we slap in uh, Navy Captain Landy? Is this what we do? We just do what everyone else does? No. We're not gonna back down here. We're gonna go Winter! Winter and Delia and DDR is a pretty solid pick, I think. Let's go Winter. Let's try it. And we can also probably go Hua. We can probably fit a Hua Young here if he doesn't go for anything too drastic. Oh, never mind. That's, uh, that's a little too drastic for us. <laughs> Navy Captain Landy is gonna suck. Suck to fight against. We at least get the stuns of Winter, but oh man, her anti-crit is so strong for the entire team. What do we go for then? We need another really strong damage dealer. We're gonna ban Elvira, because we have to. I guess we go Bologna, right? There's no real choice. We have to go Bologna, I feel. But then he's gonna ban Bunny Dom. And we're gonna get slept. He's taking bull. Are you kidding me? What? Okay, I don't know how to fight against this anymore, guys. 
How do you fight against this? Is this like a... You can't even rilet this game. Oh my god, how do you fight? Oh, I'm screwed. Hang on. I'm screwed. There's nothing I can do. Absolutely nothing I can do. What is there to do? I know Ken. There's like, there's nothing I can do here. We're gonna get slept. We're gonna get screwed by DDR. Oh no, we're just getting outdrafted in at every turn here. Yeah, it's over. If he bans Bunny Dom, it's over. If he bans Bunny Dom, it's straight up over. Straight up over. Um, because we need her to stop DDR. Please, <laughs> please don't ban Bunny Dom. Please don't ban Bunny Dom. If he bans Lionheart, I'm also kind of screwed. So I don't know. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Okay. I picked ML Ken hoping, hoping that he would ban the ML Ken just because there's a chance. I mean, ML Bologna doesn't care. DDO doesn't care about the ML Ken, right? Laya can like burst in, like one shot him with an S3. And Bologna can probably one shot him too. So thank God he banned the ML Ken. I don't think that was the right ban, but I'm glad he banned it. I'm glad he banned it for sure. Let's put Bunny Dumb in the back here. Um. I think we're, think we're good. All right. <laughs> oh no. All right, guys. Oh, we get to go first. Hang on. That's huge. That's huge. Let's go ahead and stun the Lia here. Two turn stuns, which you can't take her first turn. It's gonna be quite nice. Oh, beautiful stuff. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and sleep the Bologna. No sleep, okay. So see, Lion can't cleanse there. DDR can't S3. He could have just S2. But that'll proc the Winter. Winter will jump up here. Not jump up, but she'll reset here, so that's good. Okay, very, very nice. She still can't get hit because uh, Bologna... Bologna's a single target damage dealer. She might go for the Bunny Dom, though. We're gonna use LRK. He's gonna come in here. Hopefully we don't get countered too hard. If we do, it's fine, because we get... Bologna's definitely gonna be proccing. Ooh, please don't kill. Please don't kill. Come on. Alright, that's not terrible. It's not terrible. It, it is gonna hurt because the Bologna's gonna S2. Um... But this does allow Lionheart to go. Okay, Winter's still pretty healthy. Okay. Alright. We can go with the S3. Let's see if we can crit somebody here. If we can crit the Bologna, it would be great. Oh, did we crit her? No, we didn't. Oh, oh wait, no, no, we did, we did, we did, we did, we did. Okay, we needed that, we needed that for sure. Let's go ahead and kill the... Let's kill the Bologna, because she'll heal if we don't do this. Right? She'll, she'll definitely heal if we don't do that. Meanwhile, Landy is fine. Landy's fine. She doesn't have a soul burn. She's probably going to salvo anyway. Oh, oh, no salvo. Hang on. Uh, let's go for a hit onto the Laya, because DDR can't really do anything here. Let's go for a hit onto the Laya. She's faster than DDR anyway, so she'll take the turn first. Boom, 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 boom. Nice, two turn stun, fantastic. Let's go for DDR, see if we can stun him. No stun. Oh, he's on, oh, he's on Stella Harpa. Interesting. Well, let's go for the heal and push up here, because, uh, we do need this to heal Bunny Dom, keep her in the game. Holy! <laughs> Alright, I think we played that pretty well. I'm so thankful my team got through and ML Ken got banned instead, because if ML Ken didn't get banned, I think we would have lost. But there you guys have it. I think we're gonna call it here. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and subscribe for more Epic 7 content. And until next time, take care.